Hi guys, Rachel Bop here, back with another Sims Free Play video. Thank you so much to Fire Monkeys, Sims Free Play, and EA for early access to the preview build, so I can show you this ahead of release. And this, in this video, I'm going to be showing you the feature Wolves Discovery Quest. In order to start this quest, you need to come to the park and find this sim here with this feature walls icon of the head. Just tap that and it's going to say back to the wall and that is the feature walls quest. The famous interior decorating magazine Plush Living has reached out to your sim to be a participant in an interior design competition in Simtown. Your sim will discover the hidden art of creating feature walls and will have a chance to earn brand new wallpapers and carpets. So let's begin the quest. I'm going to do a walkthrough in this video, complete walkthrough, so you can see how long everything's going to take and how best to utilise your game when it's released to you. This is a seven day event and let's get going. Plush Living's editor, Summer Fields, is waiting for your sim in the park. She is waiting to fill them in on the details of the interior design competition that Plush Living is running. Have your sim talk to Summer. So here's Summer. I don't think I've got a sim over here, so I'm just going to call Bertrand over. And he can come and talk to Summer. It's a 30 minute interaction. Okay, that's done. Summer explains that Plush Living has identified the most talented up-and-coming interior designers in Simtown. The winner with the most new and unique design will be featured in the next edition in their excitement your sim instantly accepts. Were they too quick to agree? Let's go home and think it through. Send your sim home. Okay, Bertrand. Okay, Bertrand, go home and think it through. Okay, we've sent him home, so that's done that. Your sim arrives home and is overcome with fear. They have just promised Plush Living that they would come up with something new and unique. What to do? Panicking seems the best course of action. Have your sim panic outside near the letterbox. Okay, panic at about competition, 1 hour 15 minutes. Poor old Bertrand. Freaking out. Within their maelstrom of panic, your sim has a moment of clarity. Research will help. Have your sim read inferior designs from a magazine stack. Note, magazine stacks can be found in the home store from the living room tab. Okay, so we might need to go and get that. So, home store, living room... We need a magazine stack, there we go, a stack of magazines and we can just place that anywhere we like I guess. Where can we place it? Does it have to be on the oh it has to be on the table. How very civilised <laughs> and we'll read inferior design, that's 2 hours and 15 minutes. Bertrand, Sim can't get there, why? Can Angela get there because it's right in front of Angela. No, Angela can't get there either. Hang on. If I put it there and turn it round, can Angela read them? They're right in front of her! Maybe I need to move a chair or something. Let's just sell this chair. Maybe that's why. Yeah, they're okay now. So just be wary of your chairs. They need, they need actual access. That's done. Your sim reads inferior designs. Balconies are the new black. Futons are the future. Wait, this magazine is 15 years old. Maybe looking for trends online is better. Have your sim use a computer to browse new trends. Computers can be found in the home store on the electronics tab. Well, we have a computer, so we're okay. So we're going to browse new trends. That's 2 hours and 40 minutes. Done. Wow, there are so many cool ideas on the internet. Maybe it's time to put some of this research into action. Your sim should start by putting some new flooring in the house. Oh, okay, so I missed that, but it said place new flooring, did it not? So let me check. Place new flooring into a room in your sim's house. So we'll open this and we'll go to floors. We've got our new chic boutique one that we got from the chic boutique event. Perhaps we'll place that. Maybe not in the bedroom. Maybe in this, actually, in the kitchen. Ooh! Ooh! 
That floor looks very now. But is it enough? Does it even speak to the modern ooh? Oh, ooh uh, they put some really advanced words in here for me. Call a sim over to assess the new flooring. Speak to a, a sim to get their opinion on the new flooring. Okay, let's ask Angela, what do you think of the flooring, even though you put it down? I think that was 4 hours and 15 minutes, that interaction. Oh, 4 hours and 5 minutes. Your sim declares they are flawed at such a flawed design choice. There is nothing original about it at all. With so many ideas out there, how can your sim come up with anything new? Can your sim really do this? What does interior design even mean? On a couch, have your sim contemplate their design. So here's our couch over here. And we'll tap contemplate design, which is three hours and 40 minutes. Thank you, Bertrand. Your sim contemplates what interior design is but they are still drawing a complete blank. Perhaps they should call Summer at Plush Living to get clarification on the requirements. Have your sim call Summer on a phone. So we're going to call Summer Fields. That's 54 second interaction. Summer is not answering. Perhaps she is busy at the moment. Have your sim call back in 23 hours and 53 minutes. Oh, okay. So when you've waited that long to call, you you get this, which says your sim calls Summer and the phone rings out. Summer eventually replies with a text message saying that your sim should meet them in the park. Send your sim to the park to speak to Summer. So we will get our sim to come over to the park and tap on Summer. Ask for advice, 1 hour 15 minutes. Your sim talks with Summer, however they prove to be of little help. All she keeps saying is new and unique and occasionally trending. What now? Hang on. Seems like Summer is about to make a phone call to discuss designs. Time for some good old fashioned spying. Have your sim hide an eavesdrop on Summer. Okay, we're going to hide an eavesdrop. Two hours, 15 minutes behind this bench. She will never suspect. Your sim hides behind a bench and listens to Summer's conversation. They hear talk of a meditation space. Wow, meditation space. Perhaps your sim can come up with a new, unique feature room of their own. Uh-oh, Summer has spotted your sim less than sports person-like behaviour and wants to have a word. Have your sim apologise to Summer for eavesdropping. Oh dear. One hour and 35 minutes to apologise. He's just so sorry. Your sim apologises to Summer, they immediately realise that nothing original comes from copying. What they need to do is externalise the internal. At an available dining table and dining chair, have your sim draw up some unique concepts. So we're going to have Bertrand head home, come to this dining chair and draw some concepts up. One hour, 26 minutes. Oh, he says he can't. Do you know why? Probably because... The magazines are in the way, so I'll tap the other chair. There we go. There's Dan magazines. Your Sims brainstorming has generated a huge number of unique designs, but which one to use? Time to review your designs with some Sims. Having more opinions on the designs will surely help. Have four conversations between two Sims to discuss the designs. And it tells you how many conversations you've completed so far. So we'll tap here, discuss designs, two hours, 15 minutes. So definitely get as many Sims as you can do in this to complete it. Don't just wait for one to finish. Get this done real quick for you. So we can see the next step. Your Sims review and discuss the designs at length. Inverted balconies, reverse mezzanines, vertical pools, all original. Your Sim doesn't recall seeing anything like this on the internet. Do they have a winner? Better be safe and double check. At a computer, have your Sim research their design on the internet. Let's check that no one has done this before. Two hours and 20 minutes. What? All the ideas already exist on the internet? All of them? What hope does your sim have now? They are furious. Perhaps venting their anger outside will help. Have your sim have a tantrum outside and kick over the bin. Alright then. 45 minutes. Kick that bin. Your sim kicks over the rubbish bin, leaving rubbish everywhere. 
While the venting felt great, the smell and clean up certainly doesn't look good. Your sim left such a mess on the lawn. Now they're going to have to clean it up. Have your sim clean the rubbish up from the lawn. 2 hours and 35 minutes. Oh my goodness Bertrand, what did you do? As your sim cleans up the rubbish from the kicked over bin, they discover the contact details for the fabled DIY homes Brie. Perhaps getting in touch with her will help your sim with some ideas. Have your sim use a phone and ring Brie. Okay, let's call Brie. That's a three hour conversation. Your sim tries to ring Brie, but they all but all they get is hold music. Oh wow, that was ages. She must be busy at the moment. Have your sim call Brie back in one day in 23 hours. So that's two days so make sure you get on with this quest your sim tries calling brie when supportive her boss answers she says brie is busy and hangs up rude maybe watching some diy homes episodes will help have your sim watch six episodes of diy homes on a tv okay watch diy homes it's their three hour episodes what but I would get as many sims as you can watching the TV at the same time. It all counts. Wow, watching Brie on DIY Homes is really inspiring. If only your sim could find another way to get in touch with her since she is so busy. Perhaps sending Brie an email is a good idea. Now to find her email. Surely it must be somewhere in one of the DIY Homes magazines. Have your sim look for Brie's email in a DIY Homes magazine. We've still got our magazines over here. We're going to look for Bree's email. It's a one hour, 15 minute interaction. Aha! Found it! Well, part of it. It looks like some coffee was spilt on the last half of Bree's email address. Now what? Surely someone has an undamaged copy of the magazine. Time to phone up some sims. Have your sim phone seven friends to see if they have an undamaged copy of the magazine. Okay. Get this and... I guess there's this one call about DIY magazine, 3 hours and 10 minutes. Again, you can have multiple sims doing this, so do that to save yourself some time. Your sim asks their friends if they have a copy of DIY Homes magazine. It looks like they've thrown them out, replacing them with maternity magazines. What now? So surely someone popular like Bree would have their email on the sim book. Let's put that detective hat on. Have your sim use a computer to try and find Bree's email on Simbug. Well, that's slightly stalkerish. One hour, eight minutes. Success! Trolling Simbug uncovers Bree's email and links to the DIY Homes website. Your sim has a great idea. Why not email a copy of their plans to Bree herself? Surely she will have some great advice. But first, take a photo of the design. Tap on a selected sim with a plumb bob to photograph the design. Oh, okay. Oh, yep. Yeah. Photograph the design. 4 hours and 55 minutes. Nice photo. Let's email the design off to Brie to get her opinion. Have your sim use computer to email Brie the feature room design. It's a 5 hour, 30 minutes interaction. Your sim will have to wait for Brie's reply. Have your sim come back in 2 days and 23 hours. Basically 3 days. So, yeah, you need to start this quest as soon as it as soon as it's released, guys. Your sim finally receives an email reply. Bree says she knows a genius interior designer who can make their designs a reality. Cool turns. He became a recluse after a tragic interior design mishap. Bree will send your sim a cryptic letter with Cool's whereabouts. Have your sim check the letterbox for Bree's letter. Okay. Letterbox. One hour, 35 minute interaction. Your sim reads Bree's letter. The park is where all the answers are. Cryptic indeed. Let's head over to the park to begin the investigation. Send your sim to the park. Call Bertrand over. Your sim arrives to the park with Bree's letter in hand. Her letter contains the code word to contact Cool. K-E-1. Your sim feels like... Oh! <laughs> your sim feels like they are in one of those scenario improbable movies. Bree's letter contains the first clue can be found with a thoughtful man. Oh, that's that statue, isn't it? Have your sim locate thoughtful man in the park. Yes. Two hours and 25 minutes. Your sim inspects the thinking man statue and finds the letter CH inscribed on it. 
This must be the first part of the code word. The next clue in the letter says a cartographer's conundrum. Have your sim inspect a cartographer's conundrum for the next clue. What would that be? Oh, look, it's over here. Inspect. Two hours and 15 minutes. I guess there's a map on the toilet. Your sim looks closely at the map in the park and finds the letters ES inscribed on it. This is get this is getting exciting. The next clue is the in the letter is something fishy. Have your sim inspect something fishy. Okay, so we come over here to the fishing spot. It's going to take two hours and five minutes. Your sim investigates the fishing rod and basket and finds the letters SB on the bucket. Bree's next clue: gorilla in the mist. <laughs> Have your sim find and inspect a gorilla in the mist. Okay, so here's our grill, and we can inspect that 2 hours and 15 minutes again. Your sim inspects the barbecue and finds the letters OA inscribed on it. There's just one clue left. The letter states a box of soap. Have your sim inspect a box of soap in the park. Here it is. Inspect 2 hours and 35 minutes. Your sim inspects the soap box and finds the letters RD inscribed on it. That's it. The code word is chessboard. So KE1 must be a code to the place to place the letter K at E1 on the chessboard. Have your sim mark K on the chessboard in the park. Okay, where is the chessboard? Here's the chessboard. Mark with letter K, 4 hours 55 minutes. Apart from a mangy pigeon and a chess minded squirrel, there is very little interest in the chessboard. Have your sim check back in 3 days and 23 hours. Okay then. It seems like an age, but finally cool appears, somehow sensing the letter K being inscribed. He must be talented. Now that he is here, it's time for your sim to explain to Cool about uh, their interior design dilemma. Will he help your sim? Have your sim talk to Cool Turns. Oh, talk. Two hours and 45 minutes. This is Cool Turns. His ombre shirt. Your sim explains their interior design dilemma to Cool Turns. Cool says interior design destroyed his life and he is unsure whether he can return. What could your sim do to convince Kuhl? Have your sim sit on a park bench and ponder about Kuhl turns. As one does. Was, uh, can we just sit on any park bench? Yes, four hours. Your sim ponders what they could possibly offer Kuhl. He is a fabled designer. What could he possibly want? Kuhl just said he had a design disaster and your sim remembers what Bree said about him being a recluse afterwards. Perhaps offering Kuhl a chance of redemption will win him over. Have your sim speak to Kuhl and make their offer. Offer redemption 5 hours 45 minutes. Your sim speaks to Kuhl offering a path of, to redemption. Kuhl suggests that through your sim he could ease back into interior design. He accepts your sim's offer. Now's his chance. A million ideas come flooding out. Kuhl hands your sim a list of interior design ideas. Wow, impressive. Your sim better get to work. Send your sim home. Tap here. Send Bertrand home. Your sim arrives home with Kuhl's instructions in hand. Kuhl wants a coffee table and they tend to bring a lot of character to the room. From your home store, have your sim buy in place a beach coffee table in the house. We'll go up here. Recommended item, it's going to be in there. So you've got a beach coffee table. This is the exact one that you need for this quest. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it. Probably there. Your sim places the beach coffee table. Next, an elegant dining table. Have your sim buy and place an elegant dining table in their house from the home store. So we've got, hmm, elegant dining table. I have to go into dining room and we've got this elegant dining table here. I mean, my house is going to be a mess, but never mind. I don't intend to leave it like this, I promise. Your sim places an elegant dining table in their house. Stylish Cool's next idea. 
Bedrooms are one of the most attractive parts of the house. A good bed sh should be the way to go. Have your sim buy in place a sleep around the clock bed in the house from the home store. I may need to get rid of my bed. Let's get rid of this bed. And we'll go into bedroom. And this is the sleep around the clock bed. We're just going to place that there. Your sim places the sleep around the clock bed in their house. Your sim is worried that Kuehl's ideas equate to placing a mishmash of random furniture and they are not convinced that this will win any sort of challenge. Perhaps it's time to check in with Kuehl to discuss the ideas. Have your sim go to the park and find Kuehl. So we're going back to the park now and once we're there we need to just call our sim over. Your sim arrives to the park and finds Kuehl. However, he is napping on a park bench. There isn't any time to lose. Your sim needs to wake Kuehl up and discuss the design. Have your sim try to wake Kuehl. Where is he? Oh, he's over here. 7 hours and 15 minutes to wake him. Kuehl turns his out like a light. Nothing is going to wake him from his design slumber. Check back in 4 days and 23 hours. Finally, Kuehl turns as woken up from his slumber. Your sim should strike while the iron is hot and get insights into Kuehl's design. Have your sim talk to Kuehl about his design plan. 5 hours and 35 minutes. Your sim talks to Kuehl who listens to their concerns and says that he has a whole new concept. Kuehl swear <laughs> that may be the answer. He hands your sims a new list of instructions. Unfortunately, the list was written in a hurry and the simlish is almost illegible. Your sim will need another set of eyes to help decipher it. Have two sims decipher the list. Okay, maybe, maybe if we call Angela over, this will work. Yeah. Decipher list, seven hours and 15 minutes. Your sims work together and manage to finally decipher Kuhl's terrible simlish. It looks like his first instruction on the list is to put down some new beige carpet. Buy and place beige carpet in a room. So we're going to head home and we're going to place some beige carpet. Back again into floors. Beige carpet here, I'm going to pop that in the bedroom. Your sim places down the new carpet. It's a good start. Next on Kuehl's list is, a, is changing some wallpaper. Your sim thinks that this holistic treatment might actually work. Have your sim place some, some new wallpaper in the room. So we'll go into walls. Might try the new chic wallpaper that I've just unlocked. Yes. Your sim puts some new wallpaper up in their house. They look at the next item on the list. Wallpaper again. That is odd. Okay, if, it, if that's what Kuehl wants. Have your sim place a different type of wallpaper in the room. So we'll try this chic silver and we'll pop it in the other bedroom. Your sim puts the wallpaper up. Why list wallpaper twice when you can only put one type up at a time? Two wallpapers in one room? Your sim has a genius idea. What if both wallpapers could be put up? Would that be popular? Your sim needs a second opinion. Have your sim discuss having multiple wallpapers in a room. Oh my goodness, I see where this is going. This is going to be incredible. Let's call my sims back home because I totally forgot. And we'll discuss wallpapers for 4 hours and 55 minutes. Your sims discuss the idea of having different wallpapers up in the same room. It sounds amazing, but is it possible? Surely Kuehl Turns can tell your sims whether this can be done. Have your sim go to the park to and talk to Kuehl to discuss the possibility of having multiple wallpapers up at the same time. Alright then. No. 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 <laughs> Back to the park. Calling over Bertrand. Finding Kuehl. Six hours, eight minutes. Your sim asks Kuehl if, there's, if there is a way rooms can have multiple wallpapers. He pauses, leans forward and whispers in your sim's ear. You can put different wallpapers on each wall. Success. Now they know how to do it. Your sim must go home and try it for yourselves. 
Ooh, this is exciting. Create a feature wall in a room by selecting a wallpaper and tapping on the desired walls. Ooh, okay. So let's go home. Go into walls. I'm gonna select this dreamy heart one. Oh, look! Oh, so I think if I take it off those, yeah, you can see which ones is going on. Tap that. Oh, we've got a feature wall. That's so cool. While the walls look great, they will look even better when the wallpaper has finished drying. Your sim should come back in five days and 23 hours. Wow. Your sim waits patiently for the new feature wall to dry and it looks simply amazing. Your sim and Kewl could have a winner here. A photograph of the house is needed for the submission to Plush Living. Starting from the X outside, have your sim ph photograph their house. How cool. 30 minutes to photograph the house. Your sim photographs their house. They have to submit the interior design to Summer. The fastest way is to email the photos directly. Have your sim use a computer to email the photos and submit their design to Summer. That's 14 minutes. Your sim emails the photos to Summer, completing their submission. Is it innovative enough? The nerves are kicking in now. While your sim waits, they remember that they must thank Bree. Without her help, your sim would have been lost. Have your sim use a phone to call Bree. So that's 41 minutes to thank Bree. Your sim calls Bree and thanks her for her help. Recommending cool turns was inspiring to say the least. Time to let Kiel know about how amazing everything looks together. Have your sim return to the park. I actually left my sim in the park this time, which is probably a little more useful. Your sim arrives at the park. They can't wait to debrief Kiel on their experience in creating an amazing interior design. Have your sim debrief Kiel about the interior design experience. That's one hour and 45 minutes. Your sim debriefs Kewl on the interior design experience. Kewl is ecstatic that your sim managed to pull it off. Best of all, Kewl's back baby. Surely, surely this will be a winner for the design competition and what better way to celebrate than with a selfie. Have your sim get a selfie with Kewl. That's one hour and 15 minutes. Your sim takes a photo with Kewl turns. If your sim wins the competition, that this photo will help restore Kill's reputation. As your sim snaps the last photo, Summer sends a text message asking to meet with your sim. Have your sim speak to Summer. 2 hours and 55 minutes. Your sim nervously speaks to Summer. She greets your sim with a smile and says congratulations. Your sim is the winner of Plush Living's interior design competition. Those feature walls are revolutionary and will take the design world by storm. Summer wants to interview your sim. Have your sim start an interview with Summer. Three hours and ten minutes. Aww. Your sim's interview with Summer goes well. Your sim declares that they could not have done this without the inspirational help of the legendary Kewl Tones and Brie. Has Kewl regained the confidence to return to the brutal world of interior design? Have your sim thank Kewl Tones. Your sim thanks Kewl Tones profusely. He says that working with your sim has inspired him to return to the interior design with his own magazine, Tone Deaf. After much indecisiveness, your sim and Kewl work work together to create a revolutionary new way to decorate homes. It's time to part with part ways with Kewl and go home. Have your sim say goodbye to Kewl Tones. 8 hours and 16 minutes. Oh, Congratulations! Your sim has worked tirelessly with an indecisive yet genius interior designer and has discovered how to create feature walls. Now you can create feature wall a feature wall in any sim's house. You've also earned a pack of new wallpapers and carpets. You can find these in the home store, in the walls and floors tab. So we've got some new carpets, have we? Well, let's go check that out. Our floors tab, we've got all these new carpets. Wow. That is a lot of new carpets. All of those. And in the walls tab, we've got all these new wallpapers. They are so nice to do featured walls with. Very cool. 
So this quest is going to give you the ability to create featured walls and to give you those carpets and wallpapers. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments. I hope that this quest walkthrough has been useful to you to help you know where to spend the time and how to complete the event in the most effective way possible. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more Sims 3 Play content. Bye! <laughs>